Hello, YouTubers, and welcome to the Rock 1279 channel on this April 23rd day of 2014. It's our regular Bible reading time, and let's pray. Father God, thank you for allowing us to hear this reading on today. Give us the strength to do your will on today and meditate on your will on today. And I thank you, God, for allowing us to get into this word on today. Now, Father God, as we get ready to go forth and read scriptures today, let us hear your will and meditate on your will. Pray this prayer now it is in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay. So now we're going to start reading. Today we're reading all. Um, I had my card with me here. It is. We're reading um, 2 Samuel, the 6th chapter, verses 12 to 23. And we also read 1 Chronicles, the 15th chapter, as well as 1 Chronicles, the 16th chapter tonight. But get right into this scripture because I do have to go to bed after this. So here is the reading of God's word. The ark moved to Jerusalem. This is in 2 Samuel, the 6th chapter, verses 12a. Now it was told King David, saying, The Lord has blessed the house of Obed-Edom and all that belongs to him because of the ark of God. Now we're reading um, 1 Chronicles now. We're going to flip to 1 Chronicles, the 15th chapter, verses 1 through 28. 1 Chronicles the 15th chapter, verses 1 through 28. David built houses for himself in the city of David, and he prepared a place for the ark of God and pitched a tent for it. And David said, No one may carry the ark of God but the Levites, for the Lord has chosen them to carry the ark of God and to minister, and to minister before him forever. And David and David gathered, and David gathered all Israel, all Israel together at Jerusalem to bring up, to bring up the ark, to bring up the ark of the Lord to his place, which he had, which he had prepared for it, which he had prepared for it. Then David, then David assembled, then David assembled the children, the children of Aaron, and the Levites. Of the sons of Kohath, Uriel the chief, and 120 of his brethren. Of the sons of Merari, Aziah the chief, and 200 of and 220 of his brethren. Of the sons of the sons of Jershom, of the sons of Jershom, Joel, Joel the chief, Joel the chief, and 100. And 130 of his brethren, 130 of his brethren, of the sons of the sons of Elizaphan, Shemaiah, Shemaiah the chief, and 200, and 200 of his brethren, of the sons of Hebron, Eliel, Eliel the chief, Eliel the chief, and 80 of his brethren, and 80 of his brethren, of the sons of the sons of Uziel, Amenadab. Amendab the chief, the chief, and one hundred and twelve, and one twelve of his brethren, and David, and David called for Zadok, and David called for Zadok, and Abiathar, and Abiathar the priest, and for the Levites, for Uriel, Aziah, Joel, Shemaiah, Eliel, and Amenadab, he said to them. You are the heads of the father's houses of the Levites. Sanctify yourselves, you and your brethren, that you may that you may bring up the ark, bring up the ark of the Lord God of Israel to the place of Israel, to the place I have prepared for it. For because for because you did not do it, but for because you did not do it the first time, the Lord our God the Lord our God broke out against us because we did because we did not consult him about the proper order. So the priests and the Levites sanctified themselves 
came to the Father themselves to bring to bring up the ark, to bring up the ark of the Lord, of the Lord God of Israel, and the children, and the children of the Levites, and the children of the Levites bore the ark, bore the ark of God on their shoulder, on their shoulders by its poles, and Moses, as Moses had commanded, as Moses had commanded according to the, according to the word of the Lord, then David. And David spoke to the leaders, and David spoke to the leaders of the Levites, of the Levites, to appoint their brethren, to appoint their brethren to be the singers accompanied by instruments of music, string instruments, harps, harps and cymbals, harps and cymbals, by raising the voice, by raising the voice with resounding joy, by raising the voice with resounding joy. So the Levites, so the Levites were appointed, so the Levites appointed Haman the son of Joel, Haman the son of Joel, and of his brethren, and of his brethren, Asaph, Asaph the son of Berechiah, Asaph the son of Berechiah, and of their brethren, and of their brethren, the sons of Merari, the sons of Merari, Ethan the son of Cushiah, Ethan the son of Cushiah, and with and with them, and with them, their brethren, their brethren of the second rank, their brethren of the second rank, Zechariah, Zechariah, Ben, Jaziel, Jaziel, Shem, Shemeramos, Jehiel, Jehiel, Unai, Jehiel, Unai, Eliab, Eliab, Beniah, Masia, Metathiah, Eliphalah, Mignia, Obed Edom, and Jael, the gatekeepers, the gatekeepers, the singers, the singers, Haman, the singers, Haman, Asaph, Asaph and Ethan were, were to the sounds, were to the, were, were to sound the symbols of bronze. Zechariah, Zechariah, Aziel, Shemeramos, Shemeramos, Jehiel, Jehiel, Unai, Unai, Eliab, Eliab, Masia, Masia, and Benaya, and Benaya with streams, with streams according to Angamos, according to Angamos, Metathiah, Metathiah, Elifliya, Mignia, Mignia, Obed Edom, Obed Edom, Jael, Jael, and Azaziah, to direct with harps, to direct with harps on, on the Shemineth, on the Shemineth, Shenaniah, Shenaniah, leaders of the Levites, leaders of the Levites, was instructor, was instructor in charge, was instructor in charge of the music because he was skillful, he was skillful, Berechiah. Berechiah and Elkanah and Elkanah were doorkeepers, were doorkeepers for the ark. For the ark. Shabania, Shabania, Josephat, Nathaniel, Amasa, Zechariah, Beniah, and Eliezer, the priests, who were to, to blow the trumpets before the ark of God and obed Edom, and obed Edom and Jehiah. And Jehiah, doorkeepers, doorkeepers for the ark. So David, so David, the elders of Israel, so David, the elders of Israel, and the captains, and the captains over thousands, the captains over thousands went to bring, went to bring up the ark, up the ark of the covenant, up the ark of the covenant of the Lord, of the Lord from the house. From the house of Obed Edom, from the house of Obed Edom, with joy, with joy, and so it was. And so it was when God, when God helped, when God helped the Levites, when God helped the Levites who bore the ark, who bore the ark of the covenant, of the covenant of the Lord, of the Lord that they offered, that they offered seven bowls, that they offered seven bowls and seven rams, and seven rams. 
David was David was clothed David was clothed with a robe with a robe of fine linen, as were all the Levites, as were all the Levites who bore the ark, bore the ark. The singers, the singers and Chinaniah, and Chinaniah, the music master, music master with the singers, David also wore a David also wore a linen ephod. Thus all Israel thus all Israel brought up the Ark of the Covenant of the Lord. Thus all Israel brought up the Ark of the Covenant of the Lord. We're shouting we're shouting and with the sound of the horn. We're shouting with the sound of the horn. With trump with trumpets with trumpets and with cymbals and with cymbals, making music making music with string instruments and harps. So Samuel, Samuel, excuse me, Second Samuel, the sixth chapter, verses twelve b through fifteen. Second Samuel, the sixth chapter, verses twelve b through fifteen. So David went and brought up the ark of God from the house of Obed Edom to the city of David with gladness. And so it was when those bearing the ark of the Lord had gone six paces that he sacrificed oxen and fatted sheep. Then David and David danced before the Lord with all his might, and David was wearing a linen ephod. So David and all the house of Israel brought up the ark, brought up the ark of the Lord with shouting and with the sound of the trumpet. Michal's contempt for David. Michal's contempt for David, second Samuel the sixth chapter Verse 16. Michal's contempt for David. 2 Samuel 6, chapter, verse 16. Now as the ark, now as the ark of the Lord came into the city of David, Michal, Michal, Saul's daughter, Saul's daughter looked, looked through a window, looked through a window, and saw King David, saw King David leaping and whirling, leaping and whirling before the Lord, and she despised him in her heart. And she despised him in her heart. First Chronicles the fifteenth chapter verse twenty nine. First Chronicles the fifteenth chapter verse twenty nine. And it happened and it happened as the ark of the Lord excuse me, as it and it happened as the ark of the Lord oh, excuse me, as the ark of the covenant of the Lord came to the city of David, that Michal, Saul's daughter, looked through her window and saw King David whirling and playing music. And she despised him in her heart. Okay, now we're going to read about placing the ark in the tabernacle. Placing the ark in the tabernacle. Second Samuel, the sixth chapter, verses 17 through 19a. So they brought the ark of the Lord and set it in its place in the midst of the tabernacle that David had erected for it. Then David offered burnt offerings and peace offerings before the Lord. And when David had finished offering burnt offerings and peace offerings, he blessed he blessed the people in the name of the Lord of hosts. Then he distributed then he distributed among all the women, excuse me, among all the people, among the whole among the whole multitude of Israel, both women, both the women and the men, to everyone to everyone a loaf of bread, to everyone a loaf of bread, a piece of meat, a piece of meat, and a cake of raisins. First Chronicles, the 16th chapter, verses 1 through 6. First Chronicles, the 16th chapter, verses 1 through 6. So they brought, so they brought the ark of God and set it in the midst of the tabernacle that David had erected for it. Then they offer burnt offerings and peace offerings before God. When David and when David had finished when David had finished offering the burnt offerings, when David had finished offering the burnt offerings and the peace offerings, and the peace offerings, he blessed the people. He blessed the people in the name of the Lord, then he distributed that he distributed to everyone of Israel, both man both man and woman, to everyone, to everyone a loaf of bread, to everyone a loaf of bread, a piece of meat, 
and the Keiko Raisins. And he appointed some. And he appointed some of the Levites. And he appointed some of the Levites to minister. To minister before the ark. To minister before the ark of the Lord. To commemorate. To commemorate. To thank. To thank and to praise. And to praise the Lord God of Israel. To praise the Lord God of Israel. Asaph. Asaph the chief. I'm just kidding. Asaph the chief. And next to him. Zechariah. Then Jehiel, Shemeramith, Jehiel, Metathiah, Eliab, Beniah, and Obed Edom. And Obed Edom, Jael, Jael with string, with string instruments and harps, with string instruments and harp, and Asaph. But Asaph made music with cymbals, Beniah, and Jehaziah, the priests regularly blew the trumpets. Before the Ark of the Covenant of God. Okay, David's Song of Praise. David's Song of Praise. This is in First Chronicles, the seventh chapter, verse th the seven. Excuse me, First Chronicles, the sixteenth chapter, verses seven to thirty-six. First Chronicles, the sixteenth chapter, verses seven to thirty-six. On that day, David first delivered this song into the hand of Asaph and his brethren to thank the Lord. O oh, give thanks to the Lord, call upon his name, make known, make known his deeds, make known his deeds among the peoples. Sing to him, sing to him, sing psalms, sing psalms to him, talk of all his wondrous works, talk of all his wondrous works, glory in his holy name. Glory in his holy name. Let the hearts of those rejoice who seek the Lord. Let the hearts of those who rejoice seek the Lord. Seek the Lord in his strength. Seek the Lord in his strength and seek his faith. Seek his faith evermore. Remember his marvelous works. Remember his mar marvelous works which he has done. His wonders. His wonders and the judgments of his mouth. His wonders and the judgments of his mouth. O seed of Israel, O seed of Israel, his servant, O seed of Israel, his servant, you children of Jacob, you children of Jacob, his chosen ones, he is the Lord our God, he is the Lord our God, his judgments, his judgments are in all the earth, his judgments are in all the earth, remember his covenant forever, remember his covenant, covenant forever, the word the word which he commanded, the word which he commanded for a thousand generations. The covenant, the covenant which he had, the covenant which he made, the covenant with, which he made with Abraham, which he made with Abraham, and his oath, and his oath to Isaac, and his oath to Isaac, and confirmed it, and confirmed it to Jacob for a statue, and confirmed it, and confirmed it to Jacob for a statue, to Israel, to Israel for everlasting covenant, to Israel for everlasting covenant, saying, saying to you, saying to you, I will give the land of Canaan. Saying to you, I give I will give the land of Canaan as the allotment as the allotment of your inheritance. As the allotment of your inheritance when you were few in number, when you were few in number, indeed very few and strangers in it. Indeed, very few and strangers in it. When they went from one nation to another, and they went from one nation to another, and from one kingdom, and from one kingdom to another people, he permitted no man to do them wrong. He permitted no man to do them wrong. Yes. Yes, he rebuked the kings for their sayings, saying, Do not touch my anointed ones, and do my prophets no harm. I think I'm going to save that scripture tonight. Sing to the Lord all the earth. Proclaim the good news of his salvations. From day to day, declare his glory among the nations, his wonders among all peoples. For the Lord, for the Lord is great, for the Lord is greatly to be praised. 
He is also to be feared above all gods, for all the gods of the peoples are the idols, but the Lord made the heavens. Honor and majesty are before him. Strength and gladness are in his place. Give to the Lord, O families of the peoples, give to the give to the Lord glory and strength. Give to the Lord give to the Lord the glory, the glory do his name. Bring an offering, bring an offering and come before him. Bring an offering and come before him. O worship the Lord. O worship the Lord in all in the beauty of his holiness. O worship the Lord in the beauty of his holiness. Tremble before him. Tremble before him all the earth. All the earth. The world the world also is firmly established. The world is also firmly established. It shall not be moved. Let the heavens rejoice. Let the heavens rejoice and let the earth and let the earth be glad. And let them say and let them say among the nations, the Lord reigns. Let the sea roar. Let the sea roar in all its fullness. Let the field rejoice. Let the field rejoice in all that is in it, and all that is in it. Then the trees, then the trees of the woods, then the trees of the woods shall rejoice. Shall rejoice before the Lord, for He is, for He is coming to judge the earth. For He's coming to judge the earth. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for He is good. For His mercy, for His mercy endures forever. And say, and say, save us. And say, save us, O oh God, O oh God of our salvation, O oh God of our salvation. Gather us. Gather us together and deliver us and deliver us from the Gentiles to give thanks to your holy name to triumph to triumph in your praise. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel from everlasting to everlasting and all the people said Amen and praise the Lord. I love that one. Okay, let's pray. Um, let's read. Uh, worship at Jerusalem and Gibeon. Worship at Judah and Gibeon. That's uh, First First Chronicles, the sixteenth chapter, thirty-seven through forty-two. First Chronicles, the sixteenth chapter, verses thirty-seven through forty-two. So he left. So he left Asaph and his brothers there before the Ark of the Covenant of the Lord to administer before the ark regularly, as every day's work required. And Obed Edom and Obed Edom with his sixty eight brethren, including including Obed Edom, the son of Jeduthan, the son of Jeduthan and Hosea, and Hosea to be gatekeepers. And Zadok and Zadok the priest, Zadok the priest and his brethren, his brethren the priests, the brethren of the priests before the tabernacle, before the tabernacle of the Lord, of the Lord and the high place that was that was at Gibeon to offer burnt offerings, to offer burnt offerings to the Lord on the altar of burnt, on the altar of burnt offering regularly, morning and evening, and to do. And to, do, and to do according to all, and do to do according to all that is written in the law, in the law of the Lord, in the law of the Lord which He commanded Israel, which He commanded Israel, and with him, and with them Haman, with them Haman, and Jeduthun, and Jeduthun, and the rest, and the rest who were chosen, the rest who were chosen who were designated were designated by name to give thanks to the Lord because his mercy endures forever. And with them Haman, Haman and Jeduthun to sound out the trumpets and cymbals and the music and the musical instruments of God. Now the sons now the sons of Jeduthun were gatekeepers. David David returns home. David returns home. First Chronicles, the sixteenth chapter, verse forty-three. 
David returns home. First Chronicles, the 16th chapter, verse 43. Then all the people, then all the people departed, every man to his house, and David returned to bless his house. Okay, now we're going to read 2 Samuel, the 6th chapter, verses 19b through 23, and that will be our last uh, parable today. 2 Samuel, the 6th chapter, verses 19b through 23. So all the people departed, everyone to his house. Then David, then David returned to bless his household, and Michal, and Michal the daughter, the Michal, the daughter of Saul, of Saul came out to meet David. Came out to meet David and said, and said, how glorious was the king, how glorious was the king of Israel today, uncovering himself, uncovering himself today in the eyes. In the eyes of the maids, in the eyes of the maids of his servants, and one of the base, as one of, as one of the base fellows, shamelessly uncovered himself. So David said to Michal. David said to Michal, it was before, it was before the Lord who chose, me, it was before the Lord who chose me instead of, instead of your father. Your father and all his house, and all his house to appoint me, to appoint me ruler, ruler over the people of the Lord, ruler over the people of the Lord, over Israel, over Israel. Therefore, therefore I will play music before the Lord, and I will will be even more undignified than this, and and will be humbled in my own sight. But as for the main servants of whom we have spoken, by them I will be held in honor. Therefore, Michal, the daughter of Saul, had no children to the day of her death. Okay, that's the reading of tonight's word. Let's pray. Father God, thank you for allowing us to get to this word on today. Thank you for blessing us every day. And thank you for blessing me every day as I keep on reading your word and learning how to live, conduct myself as a Christian. Give me the strength to hear your will and forgive me of my sins and my shortcomings, Lord, that you will allow me to try to do better in the name of Jesus. And Father God, as we get ready to go forth and go on with our night and go to bed, give us the strength to hear your will and give us the guidance to understand your will. We pray this prayer now in Jesus' name. Amen. Alright guys, well that is the end of our Bible readings on today. This is Friday 127. I signing off saying, be safe. Be careful and take care, everybody, and stay blessed, and I love all of you. Goodbye.